Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect the USB, USB 2 connectors to your motherboard. For example, for the front panel. These ones are clearly USB 2 and we've got to figure out where to connect them to and where the cable is. We're going to do this with a more clean and more modern system as well. And with another clean but uh, more compact system as well. So on this board we are lucky, the USB connectors are all bright green, that's really cool. And they have a label F underscore USB. And then we have F underscore USB 2. And actually that one on the left said USB 3. But that's not USB 3, it's just the third USB connector, standard USB. So these are the connectors, the pins we're looking for. As for a cable, you just have to search a little, but basically, but basically the letters USB are a giveaway. You have to figure out where the missing hole is for the missing pin. And on the motherboard it's always the top left one, in this case, on this motherboard. So we can just... Yeah, yeah, we can just plug it in there. Gonna film this one from the side. Remember to have clean and dry hands and to try to push it sideways. Don't apply pressure from the back or you might break the cables. Also don't let it irritate you that the uh, these green casings look much bigger. This is the right place to plug this in. You can shake it a little, wiggle a little, I mean, and done. Wonderful! Let's go to the next system. We can find the cable quite easily. This one has the letters USB 2.0. Same as USB, really. Only a really, 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 really old system would have USB 1. I don't hope you have to suffer for that. And these ones not only have F underscore USB 1, 2, 3, they also have USB on the back of the uh, of the pins on the blue plastic. Really cool. So same as before, figure out where the missing pin is. And on the board it's the same, top left. And then just jam it in, holding it sideways. Just making sure. And it's in. And it's done. All right, three times a charm. This system says JUSB instead of FUSB. Sure, why not? We can find them down here. And this one has the missing pin at the bottom right, so watch out. Don't assume every system is the same. And here we have the cable. Label just says USB this time. All right, missing pin top right and left. Uh, let's make it bottom right. Okay, and we're just gonna cleanly and carefully plug this in. All done. All done. Yeah, all done. And that is it. That's how you find the USB cable, just by reading letters. And how you find the pins that it goes on to, just by reading letters. Pay attention to where the pins are, uh, so you don't break them and ruin one of the USB ports, possibly. If you cannot find this, find the manual or go on the producer's website, find which mainboard this is. I mean, here you can here you can see the name right there, for example. Just Google that thing and you should and add manual and you will find the PDF. And they always have a little mini-map, which is perfect for this kind of thing. It will show you exactly where to plug it in. Apart from that, please subscribe to this channel to support it. And I hope to see you next time. Until then, ciao!